It just happens to be that the road is completely lit up. My whole journey back. I wonder how far I had to walk. In the dark, alone, scary. Einstein, where'd you go now, boy? Nah, can't be the moon. I think it's aliens. Alright, Marty, let's do this. Watch out! I felt my spider senses tell me that car was coming. Is that Edna? Young man! <gasps> Excuse me, young man! Who? Hello, uh, Edna. Me? You're the only man in the street, and I'm looking for a man in the street reaction. Naturally, you know about the explosion that destroyed this illegal gin establishment. I read about it, yeah. What's your opinion of Carl Sagan, the stranger who single-handedly did what the law has been unable to do for ten long years, namely, rid Hill Valley of the scourge of liquor? Uh... You can mark me down as a supporter, the young man said, flashing a boyish yet virile grin. Hill Valley needs more upstanding youths like yourself. Do you have a message for the vicious gangsters who still roam these streets? No doubt plotting to corrupt our citizens with another den of booze, sin, and debauchery? <laughs> yeah, tell them, go ahead, make my day. Make your day what? <laughs> Never mind, I'll play around with it and see if I can come up with something better. Mr... may I get your name? Yeah, it's... Sonny Crockett. Thank you for Sonny sharing Crockett. your candid opinions, Mr. Crockett. Edna Strickland, Hill Valley. Alpha Herald. Zombie 87, welcome to the stream, man. I don't think I've seen your name in here before. I know. I met so, you back. I mean, I'm welcome. familiar with your work. You read my column? How sweet. I know it's just an etiquette column, but I believe it'll lead to bigger and better. Oh! Einstein, no. Down, boy. Is this wretched creature yours? He assaulted me once before. What's got into you? Aggressive dogs must be kept on leash at all times. It's the law. Look it up. Doc, I gotta find Doc. Hold down your right mouse button. I am, but I'm not running. Hmm. Why is it not running? It's not making me run, guys. Oh. If I hold the shift button down, it works. Okay, that works. Doc! <gasps> Great oh, Scott, Smutty. Doc! What are you doing here? You sent for me, Doc. What up? I did? When? May 14th, 1986. 1980? <gasps> the automatic retrieval system. Of course. I'd almost forgotten about that. So what's our plan for getting you out of here? Plan? We don't need a plan. We don't. Not in the slightest. The police picked me up for that speakeasy fire a couple of weeks ago, but the DA hasn't yeah, got yeah. a case. Yeah, yeah. It's around, Alpha. They'll me tomorrow morning. So basically, I traveled 50 years into the past There's, to uh, deliver I think your five car? episodes to it. Sorry about that, but it's so wonderful to see you. We have a lot of catching up to do. Yep. Yeah, you, yep. you tell, tell hold games. off on that, Doc. Great hey, Scott! I'm going to be gunned down by gangsters on the steps of the courthouse. Why would they do that? Guess they didn't approve of my burning down their speakeasy. Very funny, Doc. Maybe now we should come up with a plan? A plan? Right. But what? Hmm. Why don't 
I take the DeLorean, go back in time before you were arrested, and stop you from getting caught in the first place? Don't even think about it. Without my unjust incarceration, the events that sent you into the past might never happen, resulting in a paradox of continuum shattering proportions. Jeez, we've been back together for five minutes, Doc, and you're already talking about the end of the universe. <laughs> I've missed that. Don't be ridiculous, Marty. I was only referring to the end of the universe as we know it. Yeah, you guys, uh, feel free to tweet out the stream and all that stuff. Let's get more people in here, because there's a lot of people who don't know this game exists. Hmm, I guess I could break you out. Well, I suppose I could just get some dynamite and break you out of jail. No, no, that's far too dangerous. Not just to me, but to random innocent people in the past. The repercussions could be... <gasps> that's it! What's it? My rocket-powered drill. You have a rocket-powered drill? Not yet. I haven't built it yet. You've lost me, Doc. Listen, a few months ago, my 17-year-old self sent in a patent application for a rocket-powered drill. I abandoned the project after I never heard back from the patent office, but the prototype should be nearly complete. Great, I'll just run back to your lab and... No, no, I said nearly complete. You'll need me to help you finish it. How the hell am I supposed to sneak a half-finished rocket-powered drill into your cell? Yeah. Not me, me! 1931 yeah, she's me. trying to make up. Wait a minute, Doc. You want me to convince your 1931 self to it's build Friday. a rocket she goes powered into work drill to one, break you so out of jail? Precisely. You'll see her back and forth in the background. Okay, let's say I go along with this crazy idea. Where can I find you? I mean, uh, the other you. How should I know? It was over 50 years ago. Why don't you go over to the soup kitchen next door and give my house a call? They'll know where to find me. Soup kitchen. Got it. Just stay away from the soup. It'll cause irreparable damage to your digestive system. I guess I better get started. Don't worry, Doc. I'll get you out of here in no time. I'm not worried. Once you and my younger self put your heads together, you'll be unstoppable. They say you're trying to do a good job because it took you a long time to make the bed. Yeah, exactly, Alpha. This one actually came out before those games. Biff? Kid! Grandpa? That's Mr. Tannen to you, Artie. What are you doing out here? Well, I was getting kind of hungry, so I figured I'd come down here for some free soup. Just thought I'd come down for some soup. Think, McFly. The DA's throwing around subpoenas like Babe Ruth. I don't think Ruth's a pitcher anymore. Shut it. If one of those subpoenas landed in the hands of my number cruncher, I'd be in a whole lot of trouble. I could even get sent up the river. You wouldn't want that, would you? Would you? Uh, no, of course not, kid. All right, that's better. What are you looking at, punk? But, um, I picked up the Put details the as well. Suit, the details not put well, out by Telltale Games, well, what? but it's similar what are you still to the doing style here? that Telltale Games Sorry, does. Sorry, kid, I'll just like run back to the safe Like cinematic story-driven kind of thing. You do that. After I finish fly, with, uh, yes, this, that's what that I'll be playing. That hat's too flashy. You better let I'm trying me to do on to it. these episodic uh, games. I'm trying to do square one or two episodes you got it, boss. in the beginning of the stream. Don't come out until I give you the all clear. Uh, World of Warcraft. I swear, and if even one of you mooks could add two plus two so without your fingers, I'd that dump I that wind like into the lake. It out. Hey, anyway, I'm off to make myself irresistible. Don't let anyone burn down the shop while I'm gone. This old school phone. Brown Rizzles. Uh, hi. Uh, do you know where I could find Emmett Brown? Young Master Brown is currently tending to his clerking duties at the courthouse. Who may I say is calling? The 
courthouse. But I love these kind Mark of games. Never told me man. you worked at the courthouse. Especially like the Walking Dead ones, the ones that are more cinematic and story driven. This is more pointy clicky. Um. Okay. Hey, um, never mind. What are those tables for? We keep a few extra tables around for our end of the month hobo soirees. No, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. The kitchen's for management only, Rummy. Whoa! <laughs> There's no way I'm going to keep that door open without some help. Lazy hands make a man poor, but diligent hands bring wealth. Maybe that's my problem. Lazy hands. I better not talk to him. I don't want to mess up his timeline. Till later on pieces of April 14th. Yeah. You talking about uh the GTA five release? Nice rack. Yeah, we got all kinds of the uh, culinary enhancements back there. Oh what? Nice. This just got easier. Now I can puff on my e-cig. I just realized if I hold the right and left down together, I can walk. Can't do that walk dead. <clears throat> okay. Hey, um, uh, never mind. Alright, I'll have to come back. Let's go find young Emmett. Young Doc. Young Doc's in the corner. <laughs> Look at that walk, man. I hope I'll be able to recognize That's him. That's so funny. Dude, I couldn't even play it yesterday. I tried to play it, but it kept, like, glitching out and stuff. And the same with, uh, what was the other one I was trying to play? Maybe it was just the Game of Thrones one that was buggy. I was thinking Borderlands was having problems. Oh, no, no, no. It was this. I couldn't get the resolution set right on here what it was but I, I got it fixed finally don't touch those these are very sensitive legal documents nobody is supposed to handle them but sworn officers of the court Papa I, I mean judge Brown says so Judge Brown? Doc. Uh, nice to meet you. I'm, um, uh, Sonny Crockett. Emmett Brown, but I am a law clerk, not a doctor. Now please get out of my way. I have important business to transact. Naturally, H2 A multiplied by the inversion of H has to come out less than expectation value of A, right? No, no, no. What am I missing here? Or do we take H to stand for permitting a line operator? But listen, Emmett, you don't know me, but I'm your friend. I'm not big on friends. They get in the way of work. <laughs> 